G'day guys. Well, I just want to talk to you a little bit about our custom boards that we make and we send all over Australia. So what we have here is the VTEC Lithium 200 amp hour. Now, there's a few good reasons why you might put one of these in your rocket, and that is it's lightweight, two, it's a fast charge, and the one great thing I really love about this is you can manage the whole lot on your phone. So you can see it by the app, how it's performing on your phone. So what we've put here is the fuse block. Now, what the fuse block is, it's running off to our fridge, it's running off to our cigarette sockets, it's running off to our USBs, and it's all fused so that if anything goes wrong, it's right here. You're gonna check your fuse and replace it if need be. Then we have our MIDI fuses, which are these two right here. Now what they are, they're for our fusing on our DC to DC charger, as well as our 240 volt charger. You know, one of the unique things I love about the Enerdrive 240 volt charger is they have actually three inputs under here, so you can go to three different banks of batteries if need be. But in this case, we've only got the one battery, so we're coming off with the one set of wires, positive and negative. And that itself can do lithium batteries, AGM, gel, lead acid, calcium. So it's got it covered, and it also has a temperature sensor on it. What I love about the DC to DC charger you see it's got this little plus on the end? Well that's because it can charge more than the 40 amps, so they give it a plus there. It's a multi-power point tracking regulator and it's a true one at that. But it can also have an input of up to 36 volts and it's just a remarkable unit. Now, up here we have a meter, so we know what's happening at any time by pushing those. And it has a selective setting also where you can choose from lithium, AGM, gel, lead acid, calcium and it also has a temperature cable on it too to know what the temperature of the battery is. So this Enerdrive system we've made up here is a BTEC lithium. Now, as you can see, the board is made to suit the customer and he wanted exposed wiring. So we've actually run the wires. You can actually go to each item to see what it's doing and how it's working. I've noticed this board in the background while I was talking there before. Well, this little beauty here is going into my canter and we'll go through this in full detail of what's going on here. So. Stay tuned and check it out.